This is Ian Karen Cross. Today, I'll be doing as dramatic of a read as I can with my Twitter feed, with my original unreleased ambient music below it. Let's get started. Bing's gavel. If Caroline Calloway was a true poster, she wouldn't post news. This isn't 2015. She'd tweet, I stand Amy Therese. It would break this website and why she is not made for it. Doing a version of the Eric Satie piece, where you play the song 840 times in a row, except with Running Up That Hill, A Deal With God by Kate Bush instead. White people be like, does anyone else think the white slur is human-hating and based on prejudice? Okay, seriously, who was like, I need a Joe Exotic tattoo in the middle of a pandemic? Zoom hangouts have ushered in a new era of social anxiety where people constantly want to hang out and there is literally no excuse not to and I'm going to throw up. Mood check. Gift replies only. Yeah, I've been WFH wanking for hours. The wave for 2021 is going to be blasting DMT at 10 minute intervals through the entire 105 minute runtime of Dick Tracy 1990. Every day when I wake up, my first thought is how am I going to erase the lived experience of bisexual white women with boyfriends today? I never met a baby named Keisha. You only meet Keisha when she's fully grown. Have you ever just been sitting there enjoying your life and suddenly remembered to be filled with shame about something insignificant from 11 years ago? White people get in a packed elevator and say, whoa, it's a party in here, crying emojis. Bernie Bros attacking Dr. Biden for having a PhD in education is exactly what I'd expect. Y'all need to realize you're part of the problem. At Bernie Sanders needs to separate himself from your support. You do more harm to him and his policies in the country than good. Quote tweet, all right, I'm gatekeeping the word y'all from Melissa. You do not get to say it, babe. You're from Staten Island. Talk like Pete Davidson or shut the fuck up. Actually, shut the fuck up anyway. Elliot is the sweetest, stinkiest baby angel. Crying emoji. We keep using unprecedented like we're living in regular times and breaking news like there's anything else. Neither feel necessary anymore. Astral projecting myself into the HL2 beta, which exists as a gaseous, semi real plane. Wow, that amount of estrogen just like fucking opened up my third eye, but for being horny. Fuck, who wants to get topped? 5G doesn't fry your brain. That's actually just been me firing a custom portable microwave gun into random cars and residences. Sorry. Please stop doing this. You're not a public health official or an epidemiologist. You're a baseball nerd. If you told me Caroline Calloway and the hell dude would be in a Twitter beef a month ago, I would have said, who's Caroline Calloway? Things that are actually trad. Beefing with the church about liturgy. Refusing to go to mass if it's in English. SSPX. Things that are trad on Twitter. Having two children. Wearing prayer dresses sold at anthropology. Going to church. Cooking. How does one make their brain produce serotonin right now without eating or spending massive amounts of money online? Not asking for a friend. Cat Williams beefing with Quentin Tarantino over him using the N-word is the funniest shit. Three crying emojis. That's gonna be it for today. If you have any ideas for something that you want me to narrate, Leave it in a comment below. Thanks for watching. Thanks if you like or subscribe. I'm signing out. Bye.